name's Natasha, and I work with the Saskatoon Public Library, and this is my son, Ben. Hi. So we're clearly, sorry, Ben, we're clearly in our house, and you're probably in yours, and we thought up a really cool idea for a program that anyone can do pretty much anywhere. So what we're going to do is Ben's going to talk about his favorite book, and then his favorite character from the book, and make it of objects from around the house. But before we actually begin, I'd like to acknowledge that our house, probably like yours, and like all the Saskatoon branches, is located on Treaty 6 land, uh, territory and on the homeland of the Métis and we are very committed to that reconciliation and we're happy to be here. So what we're going to use is which book Ben? We're going to use this book. Okay so this is one of the Dogmans. I'm sure most of you know Dogman and why is this your favorite book Ben? Because Dogman he's kind of inspires me and my brother together and how sometimes I have to go to my mom's and sometimes he's gonna miss me and I really want to go there so I can play with him. And how does Dogman help you with that? He helps me because he really, he, he, he really has that good feeling that he's a superhero. And then you guys have your stuffies, right? Yeah. Yeah. So Ben has Dogman and then his little brother has Cat Kitten and they, they like playing with those guys a lot, right? Yeah. So which picture do you think we can try to make again from here? We could... Do you like the cover one? Is there one that you think is better? Um, we could do, I was thinking, if we could do this, just have to find the perfect one. So we went around our house and we started finding objects that we knew would be in Dogman. So I found like a big brown blanket that we can make his head out of. And we had some blue blocks and different stuff like that. But you can go around and find basically anything. Just pay attention to the color and the shape of it so that whatever character you pick, uh, it's a bit easier when you get started. And once Ben finds his picture, which should be pretty soon, we're gonna take a little break and then we're gonna move the camera and actually show you as we build um, our dog man. And it might not turn out, it might, but that's okay. It's just about having fun. Oh yeah, so he's showing me the cover picture of actually one of the other dogmans, which has a really good side picture of his head. Of the wild. Yeah, this one too. So that one would probably be a lot easier for us to make because he's got his mask and his, um, his hat on, which is kind of like Ben's stuffy that he has. So we're going to take a break and we're going to find more objects that are these two colors. We just finished making our dog man. We hope you enjoyed watching it. Uh, it was a bit tricky, but I think it turned out, and hopefully so did yours. If you want to share what you made with us, that would be really cool. Uh, and we're just gonna say goodbye, and I have somebody hiding behind our dog man book. It's dog man again! You wanna say hi, dog man? I'm just kidding, it's Ben. Thanks for watching, and good luck with all of your stay at home crafts and arts, and thank you for joining us at the library and at our house. Bye, guys.